We've got many things to look forward to with Mortal Kombat 11. As of right now, we are one week away from the first combat cast for the game, where we'll be getting our first look at Cabal. So I'm super excited for that. But what I wanted to talk about today was something else, and something that has me even more intrigued and excited to be revealed as we quickly approach the release of Mortal Kombat 11. And that is this huge surprise that's coming that Ed Boon has teased for us, and I believe I know what it is, and that's what I'm going to be talking about today. Now, we all know that there are many surprises coming for MK11, but this one in particular is related to the subject of characters, or a character, and the face models and how Netherrealm have been capturing real people's faces to use on the Mortal Kombat characters in MK11. This was a subject that Ed Boon was talking about in an interview with Brian Tong, and on his own, he brought this up. Grabbing real, mm -hmm. our faces, our actors. We find, you know, real people and yeah. scan their whole face. It's not a 3D modeler, you know, sculpting a nose mm -hmm. or sculpting face and stuff like that. It's actually real people. And we have, I'll tell you this, yeah, yeah. we have a huge, huge surprise <laughs> oh, come for on, uh, coming up for a face that you're going to see in Mortal Kombat. That's all I'm going to say. So, a face we are going to see in Mortal Kombat 11. Now, although Ed Boon didn't explicitly say it, I think we can all assume it's going to be a recognizable face, because if it wasn't, how would it be a surprise if it wasn't a recognizable face, right? Now, this has been around for a while now, since the reveal event, and people have wondered if this means we will get another celebrity actor in Mortal Kombat 11, just like how Ronda Rousey is uh, Sonya Blade in this game. And I think it has to be. If it's a huge, huge surprise, it's going to freak people out. And the way you do that is, again, having a recognizable face. Now, shoutouts to the Nethercast and specifically Shad, who brought this up on one of the episodes. Because when he brought it up, I had to bring it up too. Because it's something that's been on my mind and I've been wanting to talk about it for a while now. The running speculation here is that Shang Tsung will be in Mortal Kombat 11 and Kari Hiroyuki Tagawa will be voicing Shang Tsung in the game as well as his scan face being in the game. Now, many people know this already, but in case you don't, Kari Tagawa was the actor who played Shang Tsung in the first Mortal Kombat movie and was also Shang Tsung in the Mortal Kombat Legacy web series back in 2013. So. What has led me on to believe that Kari Tagawa is going to appear as Shang Tsung in Mortal Kombat 11? There's a couple of things to note here. And first, we have to look at the game and acknowledge that currently, there are two stages that relate to Shang Tsung. The first one being the courtyard, or as this game describes it as Shang Tsung's Island Ruins. And the second one being Shang Tsung's Nether Ship, which was spotted in the gameplay trailer. Now, honestly, if Kari Tagawa was Shang Tsung in MK11, I think it's reasonable enough to give him a stage or two, right? A stage for, you know, a big thing like Kari Tagawa as Shang Tsung in MK11. Especially the Nether Ship, because that's where this famous scene is taking place. It has begun! Now, another thing I wanted to bring up is that if you take another look at the behind the scenes video Netherrealm put up and look at this shot from the video, you will see that they are working on the face models and this one in particular looks really similar to Carrie. It could be anyone, don't get me wrong, but it's just something to keep in mind. Another interesting thing and probably the most convincing of all is that if you go on Kari Tagawa's Twitter page and scroll down a bit, you can actually see that someone tweeted at him saying, if Kari Hiroyuki Tagawa appears as Shang Tsung in MK11 with his face and as voice actor, I'm going to lose my shit and be extremely happy. And he retweeted that. It could be him showing his appreciation for some fans who are wanting to see it, but it could also possibly be a hint. Then if you scroll down a little bit more, you will see that he retweeted another tweet relating to Mortal Kombat 11, and that was about the Mortal Kombat 11 reveal event and how everyone was excited for it and tuning in. So it seems like he knew what was going on with Mortal Kombat 11 and that the reveal event was happening. If he wasn't involved in anything Mortal Kombat right now, I doubt he would be paying attention to anything Mortal Kombat, actually. Now, before I end the video, I just want to have a real talk with you guys, okay? This is me being real with you guys. 
Although I can't really say anything, and very few of you actually know what I'm about to say, all I can say is that for all who are hoping that the original Shang Tsung actor from the movie, Kerry Tagawa, is going to be playing Shang Tsung in MK11 with the face and voice, then I could confidently tell you all that you are putting your hope in the right place. That's, that's all I'm going to say. Alright, well, now that you've seen my speculation on this big surprise that we're going to be getting, do you actually think this might happen? And if it does, how excited would you be for it? Personally, I would lose my shit and I can't even describe in words how happy and excited I would be if I knew 100% that it was going to happen. I know some people are thinking it's Terry Crews as Jax. That's going to be the big surprise since there was this nice little Twitter exchange between Terry Crews and Boone. But I mean, if you look at the conversation that they were having, it was clearly just for fun and games and what if conversations. So I highly, highly doubt that's going to happen. But Kerry Tagawa as Shang Tsung, I can tell you that I am very confident in this. Anyways, thank you all so much for taking the time to watch this video. I really hope you enjoyed it, and I really hope you all have a great day. See you all next time.